Today, Kevin and I are going to be trying to find the best chicken noodle soup. We have seven varieties here, and honestly, we could have kept going. We could have bought more. There are more varieties of chicken noodle soup. However, we had to stop at seven because then it just gets to be too much. So we have the Kettle and Fire. We have Annie's. We have Health Valley, Pacific Foods, Rayo's, Progresso, and Campbell's Chicken Noodle Soup. So we're going to actually open each one of them here and show you what uh, they look like on the inside. We're gonna heat them in this bowl. Kettle and Fire has 11 grams of protein. Um, it's 14 plus hour simmered bone broth, chicken noodle bone broth soup made with free range chicken bones. It is a 16.9 ounce container. Two servings are in the container. One cup is 120 calories. So, um, it says lift here. I have never opened a package like this. Lift here. Okay, do not microwave container. Tear along dotted line after squeezing corners. Squeeze corners together here and here. Here and here like that? And then tear? Is that what it means? Well, go for it. Okay. Oh, it is perforated, so at least it tears. Yes, that was very easy. Okay. There you go. Okay. So we're thinking these uh, Fiesta Bowls will hold all this. I'm wondering if it doesn't hold it all, then we'll move, we'll go to uh, we'll do Pyrex Bowls instead. move to the um, Annie's Annie's homegrown and this one you, it's easy to open it's a uh, 14 ounce and it's 140 calories for the whole can Elf Valley is the only one here that uh, yeah, I have to use the can opener so I brought the can opener uh, just for this one is uh, 130 calories for the whole can. Yeah, that uh, it's it's a lot of water. A uh, lot, uh, lot uh, clearer too. It's mm -hmm. uh, so the kettle and fire. I'm surprised at that dark color. Now that I see these other ones. Okay, I'm gonna move this here. Yeah, it's it's a lot thicker too. Yeah. Okay, now we have the uh, Pacific Foods. Pacific Foods is 140 calories. Yeah, it, uh, but uh, the difference uh, is the Health Valley looks like it has very, very small pieces. Mm -hmm. This at least looks like it has chunkier. It's chunkier. Yeah, it has chunkier pieces. Okay, so now the Rayo's, Rayo's is 230 for this whole jar. So that's the most calories we've had so far. At least it opened, um, it opened easy. amazing that that's 230 calories mm -hmm. okay and then we have the progresso Ooh, big carrots mm -hmm. a progresso yeah they always have big carrots so whether you get progresso this or the light even the light version the noodles are it's always that size like the noodles are always that size Carrots are always that size. The big hunks of chicken are always that size. What I'm noticing is, because normally I buy the light, and this is the regular, is you're getting a ton more. Filling. So, yeah. So, like, when I buy the light, it's a lot more juice and much, probably half of that amount of stuff. So, you're getting a lot more of the stuff um, with the regular. So, this is the Campbell's, and it is uh, 60... It is 150 for the whole can. So there's two and a half servings in here. And mm. this is the smallest can here. But you do get a lot of yep. noodles. You get quite a few noodles. Doesn't look like a lot of chicken, but there is a noodle. Okay, right now this is condensed. So I'm going to add a half a can of water just so you can see what it looks like. 
So it looks more like you get the amount of juice that you do in all of them right, uh, right there. But we're going to heat them all up in the same way. We're going to heat them up in the microwave. And uh, then we're going to take them over to the table and try to fit seven bowls in at one time. You get a different view of the kitchen <laughs> because, um, you know, there was another brand that I wanted to try that we didn't get. And I'm actually glad I didn't get it because it wouldn't have fit. It would have, we would have had a hard time fitting another bowl here. So Kevin's going to move some of these out of the way uh, because we're going to start. Uh, we're going to start way down here and I'm going to give you prices for everything. Um, so the, the kettle and fire, it's is made from free range chicken bones simmered for 14 plus hours and combined with the best ingredients. Our chicken noodle bone broth soup is a classic meal made with chicken, hearty vegetables, tender noodles, and our savory slow simmered bone broth. There are two servings in this box. And we saw this box, at, I think at Meyer. Meyer, well. I'm pretty sure had it as well. Pretty sure Meyer had it, and we just had never noticed it before. Um, so. Be careful with that. Yeah, <laughs> being careful. Okay, so one cup is 120 calories. So this whole container is 240 calories. And the price, this is the highest price one here. We bought this at Whole Foods. It might be a little bit cheaper at Meyer, but it still is going to be it's the most expensive, expensive one. Um, at Whole Foods, it was $7.49 for a 16.9 ounce um, box. And like I said, 240 for the entire um, box. I tell you what though, this one looks like a really good, like a almost gravy-like. If you need to take it closer. Mm -hmm. Did you make sure you got some chicken in there too? Oh yeah, okay. big hunk of chicken. The chicken is really good sized pieces. I didn't get a carrot, but the carrots are kind of small anyway. And you're not a carrot person anyway. I'm not a carrot person anyway. It has celery in there. I see a little piece of celery. The chicken is kind of dry. It is a little dry. It, um, yeah. It, it is a good size hunk, but that's True. kind of a drawback because when you get that big of a piece, it's it's just kind of dry. It's a little dry. Mm -hmm. I, I agree. It's hard to believe you could eat dry chicken in a, in a bowl full of broth, <laughs> but it is. It's a little. It's just a little dry. Flavor's okay. It's, it's not. It's not blow me away flavor wise. It's very different than what I'm used to. Mm -hmm. Um, I'm used to, I'm just going to just say it, I'm used to cheaper brands. Yeah. I've never bought this brand before, um, but it's, the um, the seasonings are different. Yeah, I, I think that's one of the um, reasons um, it's really thrilling. How much sodium's in that? Uh, Ke yeah, Kevin wanted to know the sodium. This has 530 milligrams, and maybe that's... But is that what half it, of it, or... That's for one. So you cup. have to double that. So it's oh, so it's a thousand. A thousand sixty. Um, that's probably lower than a lot of these because a lot of these are like fifteen hundred or something. And if I All did have to make that. a comment about the seasonings, I would say it is. I don't know. It it's lightly seasoned. It doesn't seem like it's as salty as other ones, no. and that's something that makes it better. Uh, chicken noodle soup. Um, well, I, I think seasonings in general just aren't there. Garlic, no. onion, something. There's there's stuff missing from that. Okay, so that was the <laughs> kettle and fire. So now this one is the Annie's Homegrown. It is uh, organic. It is 140 calories for the whole can. It is a 14 ounce can. It was three, no, it was $4.99, $5 at Whole Foods. $5 for this can, 140 calories for the can. Oh, that tastes, tastes so much better. Um, and you like to know the sodium. The sodium is 950 milligrams for the entire can. Hmm. This looks like, uh, to just look at it like this, I told you that the Progresso, when I buy the light, that looks like... About the, the amount? Well, yes. it's less calories. Yeah, that looks like the Progresso light. Um, but we didn't want to get any white because we wanted them all to be Yeah, fair. compared equally. Yeah. Yeah, because they might have left out other things, you know, like oils or, or, the carrots are smaller. or something like that um, out of it. The carrots are smaller. 
It I like tastes the taste so different. I, I like the flavor of that better because it has a uh, it has a richer flavor. That bone broth you would think with them talking about cooking the bones and all that stuff for fourteen hours, you would think it'd be richer flavor. It's really not. It has the uh, um, the kettle on fire where it was uh, the chicken itself was very dry. That super is super moist. Yeah. Very, very moist. And it has some seasonings to it, like some I get a little bit of a touch of garlic, a little bit of onion. The chicken almost tastes like you're eating the fatty part. <laughs> it's soft, very soft. Because it has so much but it has a lot of flavor too. Mm -hmm. It has that really nice flavor. I like that. Um the noodles uh, are cooked well on both of these so far too. I didn't say that in the first one, but the noodles are cooked really well. They're they're nice and tender without being like hard or chewy or mushy. I like the Annie's more than the first yes. one, definitely. But I still don't think that has the level of salt that I like. Or because, the seasonings in general. Because that's what I'm used to. I can't help it. Okay, now this one, what was this one? <clears throat> this is the Health Valley. Pull over. Health Valley is a 14.5 ounce, so they're giving you 0.5 more than the Annie's. Um, and I do have to say, the Kettle on Fire was more expensive, but it's also uh, 16.9 ounces. Uh, of course, that's not the biggest one here, though. Um, Health Valley is, was $3.79 at Whole Foods, and it is 130 calories for the entire can. And I had never even heard of Health Valley. They're distributed out of New York, but, okay. These have the little carrots. Mm-hmm. Trying to find a piece of, oh, here we go. There's lots of little Found pieces of chicken. Found the chicken. While you're tasting that. The chicken is good and moist, so that's good. It's very blah, bland, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> it's like you're it's like they've literally taken a piece of I know it's got tons of stuff in there but it's literally like they've taken water and taken a piece of chicken and swirled it around and then thrown it <laughs> isn't that what the flavor is there's nothing there not to be offensive or anything but that tastes like something like I mean like if you're not allowed to have anything like in sodium, your food, no seasonings, anything. none. This has to be low sodium. I mean, this. Hey, that don't is, even taste the broth. I don't want to. That is. I, I don't want <laughs> to. Not good. That is the blandest soup I've ever <laughs> had in my oh, life. Oh, it's bad. So, like, so this would be my third. This would be last right now. Like that reminds me, like if you're in the hospital and you have to have special food, special diet with nothing in it. That yeah. would be it. I bet you there's not much. It's soda literally there. like water. That's why I said water with some chicken stirred in it and just give it just a touch of flavor. Oh, 115 milligrams for the entire can. Yeah, salt makes such a difference. And, and I agree, sometimes they're too much. These other ones are, are 900 and over a thousand. So when you're <laughs> going from that to 115 milligrams, yeah. Uh, uh, it says low sodium on there. Ah. But that's the only one we had. We found of that one. Yeah, so. I didn't see any regular one. Oh, so well, no wonder. So is that not a fair comparison? But that's not really a fair comparison. But I have to say that with the if that if salt is the only thing that makes that big of a difference, then that's huge because that's huge there's difference. there's but there's not really a good chicken flavor. Uh, there's no rich flavor there. It's just it's. Watery. I got the texture of the chicken. Yeah, but it's it's just watery. Yeah, it's not good. Okay. This is, and, but I'm not going to fairly compare it to the other ones because it is low sodium. It does say low sodium, and I, but I think that's the only one that they have. I, I didn't see any other kinds, so maybe that's the healthy part is lower sodium. Yeah, but maybe I, that's what makes them health valley. Is that I is would never buy them. No, never. <laughs> mm -mm, I'm telling you that right now. Uh, Pacific Foods organic chicken noodle soup. Uh, this one is a 16.1 ounce can. It was 3.99 at Whole Foods. And it has 140 calories for the can. And I'll just go ahead and look up the sodium for you. Sodium, it has uh, 1,200. 1,200 milligrams of sodium. So, oh, this one has peas. Yeah. Did it, none of the other ones have had peas. Mm -hmm. They've had, they they've had noodles. They've had chicken. They've had um, cel uh, some celery. Celery, a little bit of onion. Um, and uh, noodles, chicken, uh, carrots, carrots. Yeah, yeah, they but all this have is the first yeah, one that's had, I mean, I, look at those onions. I'm seeing onion, I'm seeing um, peas. 
He really tastes the peas. That's, that, that's exactly what I was going to say. That one tastes more like a vegetable mm -hmm. than a chicken. You don't yeah. get a lot of chicken flavor. You really taste, those peas taste really green. Peas and carrots. That's what I was, that's what I got out of that was mm -hmm. peas and carrots. Yeah. Peas and carrots. Those peas taste like a tinned pea. Yeah. Uh, they, um, they have a very, very strong uh, pea flavor. Um, it's okay. It's I, okay. I, I would, I could eat it, but I wouldn't I choose would want, to. Mm -mm. No, I don't, because I want the chicken and the noodles. And, yeah. And you do get that, but it's too strong. I want the, the I want the rich chicken flavor. Now I know why the other ones are better because they left the peas out. Yeah. I wouldn't have thought that. Okay. Now this one I'm excited about because it looks like it's got lots Rayos. of seasonings in there. Look at that huge hunk Slow of summer. So, did you know Rayos was out of Canada? I didn't know that. No, Canada's are our best cook. Kevin has reviewed a lot of Rayos meals on his lunchtime review channel. So if you've been looking at like the frozen meals and thinking, are they any good? He's all you have to do is type in lunchtime review and type in Rayos. He's done a bunch of yeah. He has a whole playlist of Rayos. So and this is a 16 ounce jar. This is the only one that's in a glass jar. Uh, it was three dollars forty nine cents at Meyer, and it's two hundred thirty calories for the jar. So that is the highest calorie we've had yet so far. And this one has a lot of green. Um, I think it's like parsley or or something just to give it some flavor. I, wow, that's a huge huge hunk of chicken. And the chicken's not. It's a it's a touch drier than some of the other ones were, but it's not as dry as the first one. Oh, I really like that. I, it's very very. Let good. me see that. It's very good. Uh, this one is what I'm talking about when I said the other one didn't like the kettle on fire didn't have seasoning. Mm -hmm. This one has seasoning. Oh. I, I'm honestly surprised. Yeah, it has a lot of a lot going on. It has uh, celery, onions, all that, chicken fat, garlic, potassium chloride, uh, black pepper, parsley, oregano. Parsley. Oh, Parmesan. oregano. That's interesting. Parmesan cheese. Parmesan um, cheese. That's what it says. Well, I tell you Parmesan what, the flavor cheese. is like so different than the rest of them. It is. So far, this is the best one here. Yeah. It, but but it does have 230 calories and there's more calories now my question is like we're going to try the progresso next progresso has light i only buy the light i never buy the regular does rayos have a light version i didn't see i don't remember seeing because that. if rayos had a light version because I'm not good at portion control. I'm not gonna open up that jar and just use half of it. No, or, but 230 calories is not bad. It's not, but when I'm used to only having 130 calories yeah, for a whole can, I guess so. it's double. Yeah. So, because I can eat, in that case, I'm just probably gonna eat the soup. If I buy the light, I know, ooh, I can have a soup and a sandwich with it too. So that's why I do that, because I, I get something else on the side. Yeah. Uh, so no, it's not bad. Um, this is the Progresso. It's this is the biggest can here. It's a 19 ounce can. So even bigger, even though that Rayos is in a tall jar, it does not have as many ounces as this does. So um, this was two dollars 35 cents at Meyer, and once again, it's 230 calories for the can. So Rayos and Progresso, it's the same calories. And this is full. And this one has the biggest carrots. They're, they're full slices. And like I said, the Progresso, the light one, has the same exact size carrots you're just not getting. As, as much. Yeah. And I'd say you don't get as many noodles or anything. I'd say this is going to taste the same as the light, wouldn't you think? I don't know, because they, they have they put like chicken fat and stuff like that in these, and maybe the other ones don't mm. have the uh, oils to it. I like them. The flavors are good. It does taste different. It's not it? as seasoned as the Rayos is, but it's good. Did I do, I didn't do sodium for the Rayos, I don't think. It was like 15 something? Rayos sodium was 1410. Progresso sodium is 1510. You would not know that. You know why? Because they have the they have all the other and, mm -hmm. I like the Progresso, I like the hunks. Mm -hmm. um, I, it's it's a very hearty, I think they put a lot in There's there. There's lots there, but. I think Reyes has a lot in there. Yes. Okay. So well, I, last. I have my two that I like so far. Okay. Last. And a third if I had to. 
this is the only condensed so you you add you can add a whole can of water we always, we always add a half a can just because we're eating it by ourselves yeah. if you're trying to feed like instead of one little kid if you're trying to feed two you might want to go ahead and add the whole can because it's going to go further yeah. so it just depends noodles are a lot different like uh, every other can had like egg noodles these have like little skinny noodles skinny noodles um, Campbell's is uh, the smallest can. It's a 10.75 ounce can. Like I said, it's condensed. Um, it was only 99 cents at Meyer. 99 cents at Meyer, and it's 150 calories for the whole can. That's what I'm talking about the calories. 230, 150. Yeah. It, it's, it, there's a big difference there. Big difference. Sodium. Oh, is there? I haven't had a can of this, and um, it only has 890 milligrams. But those other ones have a lot more sodium. Okay, let me see. Now, as a kid, I grew up eating this, and I always really liked it. Where's I the, always got the, the yeah good. There's there's some, where's there's, the beef? There's little tiny little squares of chicken in there, but you have to kind of dig for it. There, well, you had one. Did there, I have one? Yes. Where? <laughs> it was on that side. I don't know. <laughs> there was one. Where? Right, right there. There was one right in there. Wait. Yeah. Oh, I found yeah. it. Okay, just the fact that we're having to dig through there to find chicken, it says something about it right there. <laughs> but you found three pieces. Oh one my one. gosh. Okay. <laughs> mm. Oh. <laughs> I was waiting. Why did you do that? Those noodles, first of all, the noodles wow. are horrible. They're mushy. I okay. haven't had that in so long. And now you know why you don't buy it anymore. You know. But as a kid, you're like, oh, that's good stuff. I did think that was good as a kid. I really did. Eating it as an adult, it's, it's not that great. Oh, Especially when you compare it to all the rest oh. of them. I'm so glad we did this because um, I have literally thought about going like on a, a whole soup binge. And I thought since Campbell's has so many... I'll buy a bunch of different Campbell soups. Mm -hmm. No, no, no. no the, um, the, the, egg noodles, the noodles are mushy, first of all. Mm -hmm. They're way, way overcooked. The chicken is non-existent, really. I don't like the and flavor. the flavor is like... It's... I, I don't know what they There's no seasoning. It. There's no... I swear anything. it used to be good, though. But I will tell you... Let me have that bone broth one again. Just to, let me try another one. The, the kettle and fire. Yeah. Um, I will tell you, though. I love Campbell's bean and bacon soup it's like my favorite soup that i mean i really like it and um it's it's like over 400 calories if you don't count which i do and that's why you don't see me buying it very much because i i don't want to use that the many calories for a can of soup um but i really really so i know i'm like oh that's horrible but that's horrible for that chicken noodle. No. I swear it used to be saltier. The the juice used to have a better flavor. And I was, it had some. It seemed from. It our, seemed for, like yeah. as a kid that it had a better. I flavor. used to like the chicken and stars, which was the exact same thing. Except the noodles were star shaped, so they were easier to eat. You didn't have yeah. to. You didn't have to have all these big noodles. I never had the chicken and stars. It's the same thing. Yeah. Okay, so let's move these back. Yeah, we had to change our battery. We ch yeah, we changed the battery. But the battery was blinking. It was getting low. Okay, so I will just tell you, the least, the smallest can was the Campbell's. But like but I you said, had it's concentrate. You're expecting it to be the smallest. It's also the cheapest. It was only 99 cents. The largest can is the Progresso. Mm -hmm. um, it was 19 ounces, like I said. The most expensive was the Kettle and Fire. So, uh... Is there anything else that you want to, to know about them? No, we're, we're or point out about them. We're we're not considering the low sodium one because we didn't realize it was low. We sodium. We didn't realize so, it was low sodium, but uh, because I'll tell you right now, that would be our last place. Yeah, period. it would. So, but I'm not going to count it as my last place because it's low sodium. We can't fairly judge it. So, are you just putting it out of the running completely? Yeah. I, well, for a, for a low sodium chicken noodle soup, I would never buy it because it has no flavor. Well, I think probably any chicken noodle with no... Yeah, that's what I'm saying. So it's really hard to compare it against yeah. anything else. So I can't really... 
yeah. can't fairly say I it's know. last. So we tried it, and honestly, it would be last because it is low sodium, but that's okay. We'll, we'll go we for We still have six. We have, still have six. That's okay. I still would never buy that low sodium again. Okay. So what do you want to do? You want so to... I want to, I'm going to come up with my last place. Oh, last? Last. And, okay. I'll, and I want you. I don't have any problems with last. I don't either. What's your last? Campbell's. Campbell's. Yes. <laughs> this is last place. Yeah. So yeah, it's cheap. It's you cheap. Get what you, you get what you pay for. Yeah, yeah. and I'm I'm shocked to say that because it was so. It just seemed so much saltier as a child. It seemed like it had a lot more flavor. Period. Yes. And it's just it doesn't. Uh, my second lowest um, is gonna be. I'm gonna choose this uh, Pacific Foods. I agree. You it agree? It was just vegetable. Oh wow! Yeah, it tasted very strongly on the peas. Yeah, yeah, it was all vegetable flavor. You didn't really get a chicken flavor at all. Um, and then I'm gonna go for the kettle on fire. Yep, still with you. Really, kettle on fire. It may be really expensive, and it might be good in some situations, but compared to other things, it's not. It's no. Um, then I'm gonna go for Annie's. Nope, yep, still with oh you. Oh my gosh! <laughs> I think our top two. It's the same. Yeah, but this, two, this we may be one. different here. No, Rayo's is going to be my number that's one. Mine too. So uh -huh. we're, we 100% agree. That's crazy. Because Although, I do have to say, Progresso's decent. If you can't get Rayo's, get Progresso because it's still really, really, really good. Oh, yeah. But it doesn't just doesn't have the, the seasoning as the, the Rayo's. The Rayo's was, uh, there's a different, big difference in price. Yeah. The Rayo's, and they're both fit minor. Right, the and they're Rayo's, both the same size, weren't they? No. The Rayo's is only 16 ounces. The uh, Progresso's is 19 ounces. They were the same calorie. Okay. Well, they fill the bowl up about the same. That's why I was thinking they were about the same. So you're getting more for the Progresso and you're paying less. Right. That's where they've got the Rayo's beat. Right. Is the amount and the price. The Rayo's was $349. The Progresso was only $235. Right. So there's a big difference. Yeah, there. so if you didn't want to spend the money, get the Progresso, you're yes. safe. Yes, um, you are. You yeah. really are. But uh, truly, I'm shocked. I would splurge for the Rayos. Because I thought, you know, people, I've heard people talk about Rayos and how good they are. And I thought, you know, that's, that's probably not true. But yeah, after putting them side by side, and it is because of those seasonings. Yeah. Period. Yeah, even Progresso doesn't have the seasonings. No. No, it's really good soup, mm -hmm. but it didn't have what the Rayo's no. had. And you know what? I was surprised that the Annie's is as good as it was. Yes, it that was, was a really surprise. good. If you're I was looking, expecting it to be bland. If you're organic, mm -hmm. which we don't necessarily care about we organic, care. but if you do want all organic, mm -hmm. Annie's is a good safe pick because mm -hmm. it's really good too. Yeah. The other ones, I would not buy any of these three. No, no. And definitely not going for low sodium. I, I feel bad for people who have to watch their sodium. I, I just wouldn't eat this kind yeah, of soup. Yeah, I would eat a different kind of soup to or worry. Or not ever eat soup. Or not eat soup. <laughs> yeah, exactly. It's like if you're on keto and you eat cereal, it's like just don't eat cereal yeah, if you're on yeah, keto. Yeah, because that's keto Just cereal. don't get it. Not worth it. <laughs> so, well, this was fun. Yeah. I enjoyed doing this. And, and I'm really fun. surprised. You know, most of the time, the, the Morrison's brand is usually better. A lot of times case, it can be, but yeah. yeah, not this. And because not only does Whole Foods sell that, but Meyer sells this brand too. I don't care how much it costs. I would not, I just wouldn't get that no. again. Yeah. No. So I hope you enjoyed the video and thanks for watching.